Well, Mike, it's been an experience, hasn't it? It's been a, a great journey, fantastic uh, pre-season and obviously into the season as well. Um, we've had some great games, some great memories, and uh, I think the lads can be proud of what we've achieved. Uh, you know, I think yes, there's a bit of disappointment um, because I think we uh, were the better team today. But um, you know, conceding three goals away from home has uh, given us a very difficult uh, job. And uh, you know, I think uh, you know, when, on reflection, we can be proud. You've been hoarse, haven't you? You've been shouting a lot. Yeah, no, a little bit of shouting, but um, you know, I've got to get my voice back for Sunday now because it's uh, back down to the league, and uh, you know, we've got a big challenge there with Bala, so um, we've got to make sure we're ready for that one. And uh, you know, uh, it's it's been great, it's been fantastic, and uh, the lads, I think they realise uh, what we've achieved, but there's still the the air of disappointment in the dressing room, which is nice. Six games in Europe is probably more than that's well, more than the clubs have ever done, more than you could have dreamed of. More than we could have dreamed it, but you know, I think uh, it's what we want again next season, and uh, we're good enough, I believe, and uh, I think we've shown we can compete at this level um, against the best, and uh, you know, it's uh, not going to stop here, hopefully, and uh, we've got to be better, um, and uh, the next aim, you know, is uh, group stages, and uh, there's no reason why we can't achieve that. I genuinely do believe that it's there for us, and uh, you know, yes, you need the luck of the draw, but um, you know, it's. Uh, it's just wait and see, and hopefully, we can, first and foremost, we've got to win the league again to get ourselves in this position. That's the big test now. But um, you know, I've uh, got great belief in the lads, great belief in the squad, and uh, we've got a fantastic group of um, staff, players, and uh, everyone. So uh, you know, I think it's going to be a bright future. It's really given you the appetite, hasn't it? Yeah, definitely. You know, I think um, you know to compete against some of Europe's elite. Um, what better way to you know play the game and. Uh, the lads um, have uh, done everyone proud, and uh, you know I think um, we've learnt a lot, and now we've got to build on this and make sure we, uh, you know, move on. The match tonight, the early goal that you conceded made it really difficult. Made it very difficult, but you know I think we still believed even then. Um, you know we've realised I think we had to score five if they could score the one, and uh, we had all the scenarios down, and uh, they knew exactly what was expected of them, and the belief was still there, and they kept playing, and uh, we went two one up, and then unfortunately Matty's got sent off. Now no blame on Matty whatsoever; it could have been anyone, and uh, you know I think. Uh, that's, that's the pleasing thing, really. They're a great bunch of lads, great team, and uh, they stick together, and uh, they know it's one in all in. OK, so just talk us through the two goals. First of all, you, you levelled straight away. Yeah, obviously, uh, it's very difficult for me, obviously, uh, in terms of memory, when the games are going on, there's so much running through my head, but, um, you know, I think uh, to pull them back, we definitely deserved it, um, you know, and... Uh, the second one as well. Evo has redeemed himself, I think, because uh, he's probably been at fault uh, for the first set play, um, but a lapse of concentration. But, you know, he's been a, a rock, um, and he was last week as well. So uh, you know, I think I was pleased for him more than anyone to get the second goal. And, uh, you know, I think uh, we can all be proud of what we've achieved. One of the highlights that's really stick in your mind that you'll, you'll take for a long time about this run? Um, I think that the first one, for me personally, the Bohemians match, um, you know, winning 4 0 at home. Um, I think at the time we were getting heavily criticised for not scoring goals in Europe and, and we pulled that one out the bag and uh, I think that was the one where we made the history and uh, the, the reward was Anderlecht to play in front of 24,000 and you think my voice is bad now, you should have heard it <laughs> after that match but um, no, I think every, every single thing, um, it's been, uh, couldn't have been a better pre-season and uh, it's just been a joy and this is what we want and we've got to go after it again next season. What do the players learn from it then do you think? They'll learn a lot. Um, you know, obviously, uh, I think it's a, a good gauge to them. Obviously, um, what it takes, you know, to play higher. And I think we've certainly got a lot of players that can play higher. Um, so, you know, I think it's a good test for them individually to see how far they've got to go to achieve that. And um, they've learned quite a lot. And I think they've realised that they, you know they've got what it takes to move on. And uh, whether it's with TNS or with a big club in England or wherever, you know, I think. Um, They've, uh, they've certainly got it, and uh, you know I think uh, collectively as well, I think we've learned we were, we're a strong team, strong unit, and uh, if someone makes a mistake, we'll rally around one another, and uh, there's no individual blame, and I think uh, you need a great team to achieve great things, and uh, I believe that we've, we've got a great team. You're 30, you're younger than your captain, you're fresh into this job, what have you learned from it, Mike? Um, um, I've learned that I'm, I'm not looking 30 at the moment. My hair's falling out very quickly, and uh, now, on a serious note, it's uh, it's a delight. And uh, 
proud to be working with such a great bunch of individuals. Um, got a great staff group behind us, um, and the future's bright. And I, you know, it's not about me; it's about the lads. And I'll say that, and I really do believe it. And uh, it's just, it's just an honour for me, you know, to be part of all this and to experience it. Yes, at a young age, but um, you know, the hunger's there, and we'll go and try and get more. And you've got to go from Bulgaria to Bala. Bulgaria to Bala, yeah, it's it's back into it now. There's, um, you know, Sunday massive game, um, second game of the season. We got off to a good start against Prestatin, but um, you know, the focus is now on the on the league because if we want to get into the Champions League again next year, we've got to win it. So, you know. Um, a lot of teams will be, uh, you know, it's going to be a very difficult season. A lot of good teams, everyone's strengthened, and uh, it's uh, going to be a difficult challenge and one we've got to rise to. Well, we've loved the adventure. Thanks very much, Mike. No problem. Thank you.